Steve. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Hi, Steve. Hello. <laughs> what are you laughing? No, it's fine. What's up? I like your shirt. Already. I've not. I've done anything yet. <laughs> no, I know. It's nice. Hi. How's it going? It's great. How are you? Uh, I'm sleepy because it's early in the morning and I've got work today, and that's annoying. Uh, how come you guys are still up? I'm surprised to see you still had to, broadcasting. Uh, had to talk to fans. <laughs> I don't oh. know. Take, take, we're taking a few more calls. I don't know. I'm almost okay. done. You guys almost done? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, I don't really have a question. Just sort of called in to, uh, well, apart from that, like, ask you why you're still up. Uh, just to sort of talk about my experience in France. Oh, yeah. Um, how was that? Quickly. Uh, how was it? I had a really good time. It was a really good trip, uh, really good weather. Um, Paris itself, don't really have much time for it. It's kind of gross. Uh, and people aren't very friendly. Yeah, yeah. My experience. it sucks. Um, uh, but Euro Disney was great. Um, I had a really good time there. It's a shame that uh, not many people turned up for Euro game days, but it was still a really good day. Um, my favorite ride was the Phantom Manor. Yeah, that was cool. Um, but I have nothing to compare it to. But um, like I was just sort of asking like Rachel and stuff like their experiences on the the haunted manor in Anaheim, and she told me like the bit at the end with the when you're on the chairs and it, it turns around and you're looking at yourself in the mirror, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, that you have the ghost next to you and stuff. Yeah. yeah. In Anaheim, in Paris, you're just looking at yourself in the mirror. That's yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's oh, that's it. Hey, me. <laughs> <laughs> is that just like kind of like a holding of a mirror to like your own mortality like kind of like resigning yourself to like a morbid fate yeah, I guess so maybe it's just like cause maybe, like maybe cause Europeans have a dark sense of humor it's just kind of like well look at yourself don't you look a bit shit like <laughs> is that it like, don't you look I, I, a bit I, I shit know, like, we went on it twice because we, we got to go on the second time in like five minutes and like afterwards, I was just like ranting about how annoyed that like nothing happens with the, with the mirror. Like, what is the point in it? Like, yeah, I think I point? thought the same thing. Huh. I think you're supposed to see something in it. Oh, really? <laughs> I think that you should see the bride in it. Oh, really? like that she's to? she's inside it or something. Yeah. Oh, really? I could be oh. wrong on that. Oh, okay. <laughs> well. And she me. says, well, look at you. You look a bit shit. You look a bit shit. You look a bit of uh, shit, so, don't yeah. you? It, it, makes you, it makes you reflect on your life and go, I need to sort things out. I need yeah. to like, change. Yeah. I need to uh, <laughs> leave Paris. Um, <laughs> I need to leave need Paris. To leave fucking Paris. <laughs> <laughs> um, the other thing was, oh, we got... To, we, there was a kid, uh, but well, basically, all of a sudden we heard this screaming, and a woman was like yelling hysterically, which I think was in French. I'm not too sure. And so we we're like, oh, she's like looking for a kid, uh, and you could sort of. It was really busy, but you could sort of see a kid walking on her own. So we we're like, oh, just sort of pointed, and she like ran after the kid, and the kid sort of turned around and went, oh, oh, oh no, and started like running away because the woman was hysterical. And as soon as she got to her kid, she smacked the kid so hard that we were all like. Whoa, uh -huh. like, what the hell? Um, wow. That kid was, like, really far away from her mom. Like, the fact that she only just realized her kid was gone was, like, really, like, <laughs> wow. kind of and, then, and then she got a smack. And oh, then she good. got a smack for still Straight. being alive. Sorted. Um, wow. Sorted, yeah, that's what, so that's, uh, that's Europe for you. Um, hell yeah. Fuck Europe that. sounds lovely. Europe, <laughs> no, so hey, the rest of it's great. Paris UK sucks. is great. Yeah, Paris really? is whatever. Even, hey, hey, the hey, thumbs up for the Louvre. But even, other than that, it is. Even the rest of France is cool. Paris sucks dick. <laughs> hey, and I didn't. Derek will fight me on this. I didn't give a shit about the food. Really? Personally. Food was okay. I was just. I was. I was like. Hmm. I, I had way better food in Spain and yeah, in Germany. That's what I hear. Really? Germany, oh, Spain, Germany. Much, Spain I, much better. Oh, I always God. hear. It's so funny. That's not like my gut. If someone asked me where in the world yeah. is known for good food, but. Ever, it's not my gut reaction, but I hear from people all the time. Spain had the best food. Oh yeah, it's like fucking amazing. It's but they take it like real serious. Like a lot of seafood. Like, what, what was it? It's just a lot of like really seasoned well, small dishes. Like, it. I mean, we can go to like any of the places downtown that have like 
really good traditional uh, Spanish food. Okay, you know, let's go. All right, we'll go. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and you'll see what I mean. Like when we all come back from our cons, maybe mm -hmm. we'll go. We'll go there. But it's it's a lot like uh, Middle Eastern food. So it's got like all of the culture of making it really well from uh, France, but it tastes better. Huh. And it's more. I, I think it doesn't have that pretension of like this is this prepared with this ever so put on that. Mm. Okay, there's, cool. there's less of plate presentation and more of like the food is just made well. Yeah. Yep. Okay. That's interesting. Yeah, that's what I go for. Yep. Huh. <laughs> and that's why I like German food too because it's like, hey, yeah. you want this hearty ass fucking yeah. worse? It's, yeah. big old, it's big old rustic. It's a fucking wiener schnitzel yeah. and it's this flat like yeah. ba baked down thing and then you just drink a dark lager with it and you're like, this is fucking amazing. <laughs> I love German um, food. Tight. One place I would recommend mm -hmm. uh, if you ever get the chance is to go to Slovenia. And the the capital, which is Ljubljana, that's mm -hmm. a really like beautiful place. And nearby is like a small like island called Lake Bled, um, with, which has like there's like a church on an island, and you can like rent out a rowboat and just sort of row around at your own leisure and like go between the island and stuff. Oh, like, that's cool. That was my favorite place in Europe. That and Venice. Huh? Yeah, I hear Venice oh, is really yeah. cool. Oh, that's yeah. really cool. I really want to go to Europe. Are you coming to game days? Oh yeah, sure. I'm, um, I'm just trying to like I put. The, I've got the ticket for the the panel. Um, uh -huh. I'm just trying to sort of figure out my trip because since I'm over there, I like to like obviously like make good use of right. the fact that I'm in America. But I don't want to do the same thing as last year, so I'm just trying to sort of figure out the logistics of it all, like mm -hmm. where I'm gonna go. I think I'm gonna be in San Diego for a few days okay. at some point. Um, but I and like go to Las Vegas. Oh, nice. Um, but uh, yeah, I've not properly like figured it out. Yeah, uh, um, I'm just I'm gonna go ahead and tell you right now. You don't strike me as a Las Vegas guy. I think you might have fun for a day there, <coughs> but past that, I'm just telling you not to expect hey, much. Hey, I'll I'll go as far as say two. <laughs> yeah, you might you might you know what, think, you might have fun for two. I think, I think anyone I think, could find two days people, of shit. Most, I think most people could find <coughs> could spend two days there. Yeah, but really, I like, was planning for two. Yeah, I was planning for two. Okay, like, good. Yeah, good. Two days, yeah. two nights. Make sure you got Tinder on. Hell yeah, the dude, yeah. The Get some US also, Tinder. When, when, you do, like, when you're on holiday, though, you're sort of a bit more open to, like, different yeah. things, you know? You, yeah. You're less like, I'm not fucking doing this. Yeah. Like, uh, but yeah, I, I thought maximum two days, like, I'm not, yeah, I, I know exactly what you mean. Do you, do you gamble <laughs> um, at all? Yeah, do you gamble? Uh, no, I don't even dabble. I don't even dabble in gambling. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Go, hey, definitely go see the Beatles Love Show. Yeah. Absolutely okay. go see yeah, that. Yeah, go see that. If, if you do nothing else, go see that. And if you want, if you want like a second show, that um, one that I highly recommend that is cheaper and is a great just magic show, honestly, it's Penn and Teller. Huh. That was like the best huh. deal. For what for all the shows I've seen, that was the best where it was like 40 bucks and they did a ton of cool shit and yeah. gave everybody shit. It was like it was like worth the money. Blind they gave me like a there. book for attending and it was like about magic and stuff it was like just for going cool. oh, it was cool. really like the whole experience was really really good and cool. it didn't really cost anything I'm gonna go the other way for it I say go shoot an assault rifle that too <laughs> okay so assault rifle first night Penn and yeah Teller, Penn and Teller night. second night yeah. yeah and then you know what okay. you do what you do during the day is the, up to you the the other Cirque du Soleil show Cirque du Soleil shows it's not like they're bad but I've seen them and I feel like they were all really expensive and just kind of like, yeah, wow, it's crazy. After after 20 minutes, I'm like, I got it. Yeah. The Beatles yeah. is the one, the Beatles love is the one that has the emotional yeah. anchor of the Beatles. Yeah. And it takes you oh, through the all their music and by, by the end, you're like real emotional. Oh, what, what the yeah. fuck? What? It's doing shit inside my head. Oh yeah, there's like pop rock shit ah. in it. Yeah. Ah. Mm. Mm. I don't like it. Go away. Sorry. Um, well, Steve. One of one, sure one other thing. Um, yeah, one more, yeah. Quickly. Uh, I went to the Louvre, but uh -huh. unfortunately, we only got to spend like an hour there because oh, we, took quite a while to, we took quite a while to get there because we were all so fucking tired all the time. Uh -huh. um, we, did, we didn't know it was closing, but we get there, we buy a ticket, we go in. Uh, like literally half an hour after getting in, all of a sudden they start like leading people like out. Which the, the only oh. good thing about that was that they led us for like an entire wing to get out, but it was still kind of annoying because I really wanted to spend a lot of time there. Yeah. But there was this one guy, there was this like family and the kid, like this one like kid, but he looked about as tall as me, just kept like going to sleep on things. Like he went to sleep on, <laughs> they, we're in the Egyptian like section and there's a guy like, for, like just resting on a sarcophagus, 
like being really sleepy and he did yeah. it like three times and uh and then they did it somewhere else and there's a uh, a female attendant sort of just going get up um and then later <laughs> on we saw like his dad slumped in a corner asleep i think rachel got a picture of him um, <laughs> but uh it was like the sleepy family or something i have no idea what the fuck was Oh no, we lost. Oh, uh, oh, 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 we lost. Oh, oh, your connection. Your oh, connection was okay. cutting out. Well, yeah. Uh, have a fun day at work. That's what I'm gonna end on. Okay, right. have a fun day at work. Have Thanks fun day at work. Stevie was a good call. No, no, no one appreciated Leo Vader's joke. Sounds like you were unlucky in Louvre. <laughs> I love it. Hey, if you go to the if you go to the fuck store, <laughs> buy me a new mouse. Um. Um, don't forget Mother's Day. Um, the uh, I was going to. Oh no! If you go to the Louvre with, uh, I would say three hours or less. Yeah. I would. I would not go. I would. Huh. I would wait. Wow. Yeah. That you'll you'll walk in the door and look at something and then go. Oh fuck! They're closing. Or yeah. I have to go. 